fish. I think uh, what? I think I'd be best to come back with Willie. So the mine up there on the right, I don't actually know what it's called. It's, it has eagle in its name, that's all I remember. And then obviously the ones is that roof weight or rough weight mine. Right. And then this one, I have no idea because I didn't even know it existed. Can you tell the size of the mine by the size of the spoil heap? Um, well, I suppose you could really. Although saying that, the one, the one next to the waterfall down there yeah. doesn't have a spoil heap. Right. I don't know. I mean, it's literally, it's really, literally right next to the river. So it's probably just washed down in the river. Oh, all right. That but that's quite, it's quite a big tunnel. What? That, that there looks like a huge mine up there. Yeah. But well, it would have been. Yeah. This one has a pretty big spoil heap. I mean, that's a lot of stuff to dig out. Right there. Nope. I'll just buy it. I'll buy it when I buy all the climbing stuff. Oh, yeah. I think. Don't get me in this video too Alright, no worries. Very interesting. Two hundred lumens. That roof doesn't look safe at all. I mean, it's probably been there several hundred years. There we go. In look. Yeah. The ends there. Uh... Aye. Oh. Huh. I'll have a quick look. And obviously, I'm not going far, am I? But. I nearly showed that in your eyes then. Yeah. Would have blinded you. Yeah, I'm really free, isn't it? Yeah. Looks like there's been a cave in there as well. Actually, do you reckon I reckon? No, I reckon that's just where it's collapsed. Yeah, I collapsed in there. Yeah. I probably, yeah. All right, well that was kind of cool. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna walk over the top of it. Don't worry. See where this rock's been rusted. Eh? See where this rock's been like rolled and rusted. Yeah. Aye, yes, yeah, so it's like collapsed right there. What? It's collapsed there. Oh, it's collapsed. Oh. So whatever mine was there, you can't get there now. In there? Ah, oh, fair enough. <laughs> Yeah. The train has got fucking ruined. It's like covered in food and shit. Yeah. Um, um, these are more outside. These are only other shoes left. You have to wear these uh, tubs to nightclubs for everything. Which on one hand was beneficial because it had another inch. Mm -hmm. If I stood up straight while wearing these, look 6'3. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite nice. Yeah. It's dead comfortable as well. That's yeah. why that's why I wear these boots all the time as well, just just for the heel. Yeah. Just add to, just add that like extra two inches. So I look so I look like I'm over six foot when I'm not. These are perfect for that. Then at the same time like they are extremely grippy, like so grippy in the snow. Yeah. On grass and rocks they're fine. They're extremely grippy in the snow. Interesting. 
on everything else they are not gripping whatsoever like if I stood in that rock I'd slip off they're so slippery on rocks uh -huh. and I fell, fell down the stairs in a pub wearing these <laughs> did you? yeah great it's so embarrassing in this pub it's like a little chalet I had my pint I was up the stairs I walked down the stairs put, put my foot on one step slipped to go Whoo! I nearly fall I was squatting and I grab onto the rail everyone looks over and I'm still holding my pint I might still have another sip I step down the next step oh my step god down there as well do the exact same thing except I throw my pint in the air and I spill it I spill like the top third on my shirt and everyone turns over and goes way I was just shook your fist there <laughs> yeah everyone turns around and goes way and then puts on a pint and carries on drinking again. Oh no, fuck. alright. So we go to the next step, do the exact same thing again. This time spill half a pint down my sleeve. Everyone turns around again and the whole pub is looking now. And we're like 50, <laughs> 60 people sake, in this man. small downstairs of the pub. Half of them are like old men, but all the families and shit. And all go, way! I mean, I'm just stood there, oh fuck's sake. <laughs> and I walk to the bar and I have a finish a pint and then. Guy's like, oh, lucky George. Uh -huh. You are. Huh? It was quite nice actually. Like, everyone knew you by name, and like you've seen there. It's like you knew everyone. Yeah. So when I was coming up here, I did think because I knew the the mine next to the river was like by some trees. Yeah, it was there. So I thought it was there, okay. but it wasn't. There was nothing there. It was just a rock. Do you not just want to start digging your own mine? Um, I mean, I would. <laughs> Found that pickaxe at the uh, the quarry at Staten that time. Was that with you? I can't remember. It was either you or Christian. We found a saw one time as well. A saw. A saw. A saw. Yeah and cut down the tree. I think that was probably them. Although they're melted now, so you can't really tell, they just look like circles. All boarded up because you couldn't possibly stay here when there's corona going on. That would be such a bad thing. Oh, is this like a business? I don't know. Might not be actually. Outward bound all the water. I don't know. I just guessed it was. Anybody home? Oh, nobody's in. I'm going to keep out the under a rock. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> so slow this shit around here. Mmm, lovely. Going all the walls somewhere. Hi. We'll be in the gutter. We're gonna pick lock it. Lock pick it rather. <laughs> oh, look to your left on that rock. Oh, it's a little ledge. The grey one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, you've got the key. Because it wouldn't surprise me. No, that's what they would do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. 
I think there's probably logs under that roof bit there. Oh well. It's not end at world, is it, sir? Even the snow that's left is super slippy. I've got it on this. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. No problem. So, on this forum that I was reading about this valley, and someone said that they thought this was Roughweight Mine. Just uh, up from the lodge. But this is not Roughweight Mine. I mean, I guess it's one of them. It is at the Roughweight Lodge after all. But yeah, it doesn't go in far. I actually came in here yesterday and somebody had left a bottle of beer a big bottle of Peroni and it was full unopened I haven't drank it yet what the hell is that slimy shit what the fuck you got a bone down there probably a sheep or something hold up So I came in here and right down here. Alright. I'm not going in there. Alright. How far in did it go? Just to here basically. Oh, uh, is that it? For this one, yeah. Yeah, that's where the bottle of beer was, right there. Cool. <laughs> Some mushrooms as well. Oh. Don't think they're magic though. I'm gonna film this too, cool. What? I'm gonna film this. Oh yeah. yeah. Head out. Da -da. Careful of the water. Yep. I'll go down to that one first. Yeah. Huh? Down down there. Yeah. I'll go down this grass there. And uh I'll leave my bag on this rock so I don't need to take that in with me.
Just checking out, I'm actually recording. Um. There it is. Big waterfall. Here he comes. Doing a bit of filming for himself. What are you putting that bit? What? What are you putting there? That's what I did. I'd see that. That works too. A while. What? A while. It's just like it's just like this all the way. It's not alright. Not that deep. I mean, I just kind of walked through it. Okay. Oops. Spooky. There's not really any point in having it put it like, because I had it on 25,000 lumens then, but there's not really any point because it's kind of only so bright you, you can get in like this kind of area, you know what I mean? Yeah. So this is only on 200 at the moment and it's perfectly fine. Okay. Quickly, There's um, sheep bones and stuff. It's so obviously uh, a sheep's got stuck in here. I don't know. That's a bit deep for my boots there, I think. Is it? Yeah. Huh. I don't want to get wet up here. What, they're not waterproof? Not that waterproof, I don't think. Huh? What if you just walk across the rocks? Nah. I'll go wet outside, I think. Okay. I won't be long. I'll be quick, mate. Yeah, I won't be long. Like All right, turn, turn around. You don't want to. You don't want to look at it. <laughs> what the fuck, me? That's brighter than like house. That's mad. Just it's all weird rocks, isn't it? Yeah, weird rocks. Don't look at it. Sorry. <laughs> You're freaking blind yourself. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah. 
What? Oh, what do you mean? What? What do you mean? Why do you need to time it? No. I'll be fine. I'm just going. In, I'm just going to the end, and I'll come back. Oh, hello. He really. Uh, he do be stressing. Anything interesting on that? No. I'll leave that down there. Right, yes. Oh, here's all the bones. Ooh. All the sheep bones. Ugh. Oh, this is 200 lumens, actually. It's not very bright, is it? This is two thousand. This is 1,200. Either 2,000 or 4,000, I can't remember. Oh. Right, there we go. If you wash it up and if you cleaned it up, it might look nice. Okay, let's get to the end and uh, we'll head back before my friend freaks out. Mm. What the hell is that? That's pretty cool looking. I might keep hold of that. <laughs> I say as I drop it. So this is where I got my rock samples from yesterday when I came in here. I put pictures of those in the video. Um, yeah, and the smaller mine that I was in before that is the one where I found, literally found a bottle of, um, of Peroni in there. What the crap is this? I really need to do, um, to get educated on geology, I think. I don't really know what I'm looking at. Got some drill holes there. Pretty cool. And on this bit, it starts getting lower down. Oh, let's just crouch down a bit. Some more drill holes. It's actually quite a lot of them. The end of a fag. Lovely. And yeah, we're basically at the end. It's another bow. Okay, I guess it's time to go back. <gasps> Someone had a Mars bar in here. Or is it a whisper? That could actually be a whisper. 
Why am I talking about chocolate bars? What the hell? Let's just go back. lit up now. This, this looks nice. Let's take that. Rock samples. Maybe one day I can figure out what they are. Alright. Every mine I go into, we've got to do this. Oh my god, you can just see it at the waterfall. It's spooky. Okay, let's continue. Don't want my friend freaking out. A lot of footprints in here. Well, there we go. That's our rough weight mine. So we've got uh, that small mine just there that we were in before. That's the one that's about eight or ten meters long. And then the one down there by the waterfall. So yeah, I don't know what the best way to get up there would be. I'm guessing we'll just go down the path and go back up. When I cross down there. So I thought there was actually a path up to there, but I can't actually see one now that I'm here. Yeah, it does actually look like, I mean, I don't know if you can see it on the screen, it looks like there's a path kind of along there. But obviously you need to be high up, which we're not, so we have to go up from the bottom. I guess the best way to do it is from down there. Oops, maybe it's better. Oh, 
called the, uh, I just turned around at the wrong time over the years. His hat blew away and he was running, I was wondering why he was running up. Because he lost his hat. Oh shit, we're not even there yet. Bloody hell. This is exhausting. Oh, I should just be over there then. any of his entrances I'm gonna be pissed off. Entrances. I've seen pictures of like three or four of the entrances. Three or four, what? Entrances. Is there anything in there? Water. Yeah. The summit. No, right, the fog's coming in, it's getting dark to pick one. Isn't it? What? The fog's getting in, it's getting dark. Okay. I've got a 25,000 lumen torch, mate. What? I've got a 25,000 lumen torch. That is very interesting. Oh. oh shit. I think uh what? I think it'd be best to come back with wellies. I can go through it for some way. I mean, I can see about, I mean, only about 20 metres back, but it could be a turn, I don't know. It's hard to tell. Looks cool, though. Because it's like, um, you know the one that we saw further down? That was like the built-up tunnel into the entrance. Yeah. Yeah, it's like that. Oh, right. But you can't actually see the actual entrance into the, into the land over there. Okay. <laughs> This has got copper in it. Huh? This has got copper in it. What does? This is green. Yeah. Whoa. Right, go on, let's go down to that main snacky. Ready for the lag? Yeah, I It's too quickly though, yeah, you can see the fog. I'm pretty sure that's just a drop in it. <laughs> you go around to the left. To the left? Yeah. Okay, sure. I thought you said left. Easy 
sleep easy. This is interesting. Must be some kind of mine entrance down there, I'm guessing. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Yeah? Huh? Yeah. Is there? Ah. Yeah, I was going to say, so I was looking there and I was like, there's nothing there. It's weird, it's weird. These look like they could have been old, might have been filled in, I think. This is what? There's wood and shit, wood beams there. A little bit of wood. Mmm. Trying to buy. See what? Get past. Oh shit, yeah. There's that wood there, see that wood? And those sandstone pieces. Yeah. Good. Oh my god. What? Is it? No. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking hell. Fucking bulletproof. <laughs> it's armor. Yeah, I reckon that's top of 50 cal. <laughs> yeah, that's like a bit. Fuck me. Wait, film that, are you, are you filming it? I think so. Yeah. So, I mean, this is the clip here. <laughs> Go on then, do it again. Just make sure I got it. Wait, you broke the frigging rock. <laughs> Look at the rock under it. You broke the rock. Oh, it is. It's just iron. Oh, what's inside? <laughs> Nothing. Just, mo just rocky stuff. Hmm. Well, this this is kind of weird. Is that a mining hole? Hmm. Let me know in the comments what you think. If we go down this way, maybe. I'd assume the different adits are at different levels on the hill. The, like the different adits on the different, like there'll be different levels of the mine. So they'll all be at different heights. Hi. But I mean, that hole that I found, like it was only small, it would have been easy to have missed, you know what I mean? And I have a feeling the rest of them are kind of like that too. Right. I mean, like, it has like a really like wide angle. Like it just brights up like everywhere. Instead of, it's not like I focus. It's really hard to get focus on. Yeah. Like the way LEDs work. <laughs> It's like it's hey, it's like it's daytime. It's a nice summer's day, it is, isn't it? Oh, 
<laughs> well, you are only supposed to leave it on this setting for like a minute and a half because yeah. it does start getting properly hot to hold. Like people have complained about it like burning holes in their bags and stuff because like the button is like kind of easily knocked. Um, <laughs> oh. It must kind of fuck with your brain that. <laughs> I mean like just like the brightness and I go into darkness like really quick. Because I mean humans would have humans would have evolved for it to like gradually get dark, you know what I mean? Not just for like mega bright light and then just light out and it completely dark. I think I can figure it out. What? I can figure it out. What do you mean? Figure it out. What? No, I don't mean your conscious I don't mean your conscious thought. It's open down there, trying to see. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh shit. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Imagine someone walking down there, they have no idea we're here. Can you see, can you tell if my GoPro's still recording? Yeah, still ready. Okay, good. Ready? Tell me when you're ready. Oh shit. <laughs> I probably will on this because it's not very good in low light, so I don't think you'll really be able to see much over there. Yeah. Like looking down without it. Nice waterfall over there. I hope they're not coming up to rescue us. <laughs> nah, Oops. I haven't got any calls though. <coughs> yeah. Or well, the most objects within a range. Mm -hmm. So they'd have to have both a wild, like, wild, wild field. It depends what I'm asking. Does that mean something that they can light up the moon from here? Can you see that road in front of you? Yeah. Can you really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you okay. can see it. <laughs> I don't really want to be in the films though, that's right. 